Hey y'all, it's Real Nigga Games, AKA Bad Walker, just making a video on why I chose the console I'm getting. And if you haven't seen my other videos, you should know that I'm getting a PlayStation 4. The reason I'm getting a PlayStation 4 is just start off the first reason. One, it is cheaper. It's not that I just don't want it. I'll get into them later. It's one that's cheaper. It's $100 less. And when I got on Amazon, it was like three cents less. The first time I got on when I wanted to pre-order an Xbox One, it was like three cents. Cause I wanted an Xbox One before. So watching the interviews, the Prince conference, my mind just, they started just, they just started fucking with my emotions. So I just said, fuck it, I'm getting a PlayStation 4. Uh, the second reason, is the game. I was like, I'm not really like a PlayStation 4 guy because I have an Xbox 360. You know, I'm not, I don't really know a lot about Sony. I only played a couple games on Sony. So, I mean, like, I used to start off with PlayStation 2. If you would know from my old videos, you can go check those out in the description below. But I said that I had PlayStation 2 back in the day. So, I kind of understand it a little, but I don't know a lot about it. So, I'm a product to play a couple of games like uh, Kingdom of Hearts 3. I'm going to get that game because that looks pretty decent. I never played Kingdom of Hearts. Well, I played it, but I never finished. And it looks like a game I could probably get into. Uh, Watch Dogs, I heard it looks so magnificent on the console, and I just want to play it just because, you know, graphics. And it, the third reason is it records gameplay. And since it records gameplay, I don't need a DVR like that, but I might get DVR for, you know, better quality. Because I know, like, usually when they give you something, it's, it's, just, it's not really the best quality, but it's okay. So I'll get something to probably boost that shit up, and it'll make it look great and nice. So when I post it on here, y'all won't be bitching, talking about, oh, some lag in there. And uh, the fourth reason is, well, it was going to be the on free online, but apparently they're going to make you pay for that too. And I can understand that, because they've been doing the free online for the longest, and they kind of lose money. So whatever it is. Knowing them, it's not it's not even gonna be that expensive. So I'll, I'll knock out I'll knock I'll knock out some money for that. Uh, the fifth reason is probably uh crap. What is the fifth reason? Oh, because Microsoft has fucked me over as a fan and as a consumer because they are not using their proper fuck. What's the word I'm looking for? They're not using the proper like strategies and tactics to come to get me as a consumer. I pay, I got like a A in economics. So I know what the fuck I'm talking about when it comes down to consumer. Consumerism and shit. Big ass word that I just fucking use. I don't even know it's a real word. I'm gonna annotate that shit somewhere if it isn't. So um they should like they should make it look more like valuable to me because right now it's looking kind of it's looking like a big ass brick to me because that's all the fuck it is it's a brick that watches you while you sleep and it can check your heartbeat and shit but other than that it's the game's rise it, it, it exclusives look retarded and have them ain't really exclusives they're on the playstation 4 too so i can play the xbox games that they're coming out some of the xbox games they're coming out with and i can play and plus the real exclusives are shitty like rise it's fucking it's fucking history class in a fucking game i don't want to fucking learn like, well, Assassin's Creed is the only game that I'll play that I can learn from. And Assassin's Creed is top notch shit. Like, it's real nigga shit. Rise just looks like some bullshit they just put together. It's not, it looks like fucking God of War with Romans. So, it's just bullshit. So, I'm not getting that game for sure. And that's another reason I'm not getting the Xbox One. The sixth reason is probably the. Yeah, I already got the price is number one. Fuck, I'm backtracking. I'm sorry. I'm, I don't feel like editing. And. This might be just be like one track video, you know, I'm gonna throw some music in the background and shit, y'all ain't gonna be listening to it, y'all gonna watch it, da 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 da. But, um, the sixth reason is probably the controller, because when I was looking at that video that I uh, put in the description below yesterday, if you haven't seen that video, I'll put that in the description below. I'll put a lot of shit in the description below, or annotated and shit, but for mobile users, it is in the description below. It's like the controller is, well, it's, well, it's more done, because I didn't like the PlayStation 3 controller, because it's kind of small. And I got my hand wrapped around it. I love the reason I like Xbox because the Xbox controller is big enough for me to hold in my hand and it'll feel comfortable. And I can, you know, maneuver my hand and shit and I can do what the fuck I want. <sighs> but the touch screen thing I thought was pretty cool and I think that's pretty interesting. It's something new that game controllers haven't really done yet, except for the Wii U with the touchpad. So, yeah, don't think that, you know, don't cancel out that Wii U. You know, you gotta think about them too. The seventh reason is probably uh, power wise, because I heard it is more powerful, but saying it's more powerful, it doesn't really matter because the Xbox is still the Xbox ever known for number one. 
Xbox Live and shit, and they're pretty great. But it's not something I could probably get into without knowing how to use it. Uh, the eighth reason is probably I don't want to connect watching me all the time. So, you know, in the end of the day, I, I kind of can't let, gotta let that go. Number nine. And then I guess this will be the last one. Number nine is probably uh, size-wise. That PlayStation 4 is not as big as the PlayStation 3, but it's pretty much smaller. And the Xbox One is just like, it's fucking huge. About the same size as the Xbox Elite. So, well, it's about the same size as the first Xbox that came out. So, you know, there's going to be a lot of hard time trying to figure out where I'm going to put it and like where, what spaces I'm going to use. Because like right now I'm living in my apartment and it's kind of small. So I don't really have a lot of place to use it. Because when I move out, I gotta find, and oh, the 10th reason is the internet. I will be in the military, so the internet is gonna be kinda hard to come around to, being in the military. And I don't think they have like Wi-Fi everywhere, so I won't be able to do all that. And you know, but when I come home from base, you know, or uh, be on leave or whatever, I'll probably, you know, play online with my PlayStation 4 and do the fuck I want. Bounce. But um, what else is there to say? I mean, the Xbox, I can't cancel it out. Like, it, I was just blowing off steam, but it's a good console. If they change it within the year, I'll possibly, possibly recommend it. But until then, I'm gonna be on my own, doing my own thing, you know, getting this money, counting this paper, fucking these hoes. So like, subscribe, and comment, and share this shit. Because of negative some subscribers, you know what I'm saying? So, peace, love, I'm out. Enjoy this song, because I'm going to put the, I'm gonna put the uh, name of the song that I'm using in the description below so you can check that out. Also, today, Yeezus and J. Cole's album just came out. Y'all should go get that. I just downloaded Yeezus for the week. So, you know, uh, I'm a bad guy. So, y'all know how it is. It's Run That Games, and I'm out.